What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another FIFA 19 video. Julian Brandt has won the Bundesliga Player of the Month and the first thing to note is that his face card stats look pretty decent and he only requires three segments which could be great and it could be terrible depending on EA. If that's like three 86s or an 86, an 85, an 84, probably a bit expensive. If it's an 85, 84, 83 or less than that, Probably looking at it being okay. Um, looking at the card itself, 6-1, brilliant. Medium, medium, brilliant for a centre mid, of course. Four star, four star, brilliant. Like this, the the again, the face of this card looks very good. Um, absolutely spectacular pace for a centre midfield. Uh, I'd say something that you wouldn't need to change at all. Um, his positioning is good, again, for a midfielder. Finishing shot power and long shots are fantastic for a midfielder. Volleys and penalties last year and previously were two categories that I just used to dismiss. I just used to say to you guys, don't even worry about those. Don't even take those into consideration when looking at players' stats. This year, I'd say the same for penalties, but because of first-time shots and the scoop volley being so overpowered, volleys, I think, are actually quite important. So he does lack a little bit there. His vision is great. His crossing is great. His short passing is great. Curve is good. His long passing is a bit weak, but as a center midfielder, I don't think it's super important. It depends on what EA determined to be a long pass versus a short pass. Um, agility, balance, reactions, ball control and dribbling are, are good, very well rounded and then his composure is a little low and that might impact your team again, this, this like depending on how expensive he is uh, not the greatest jumping and his defending is terrible but as a centre mid that you'll probably play as a cam or at least a box to box midfielder no, I don't even think he suits a box to box midfielder he doesn't have the, the stamina and he doesn't have the defending for it I would play him definitely as either an attacking minded midfielder or a cam um, and then his strength is okay, his aggression is terrible, his stamina is okay for a guy with medium, medium work rates that might sit higher for you, his stamina is decent. So the only downsides to his actual stats overall are A, he's got relatively low composure, B, he's got relatively low volleys, and C, he's not end game. He will be the sort of card, and we'll go on to Futbin and have a look. He'll be the sort of card, and, and I want to I, like, I wanna determine what I find to be end game, okay? Because I, I think this year the, the needle has moved quite a lot with what we're saying is or isn't end game. So when we look at um, Brandt here, you see these ratings here, 83, 88, 90, uh, whatever. What I would consider to be end game is 96 or 97 here currently. Last year it was the same. When team of the season comes out, I would I would assume end game is literally 98, 99. So once you put the chem style on, you get them up to that point. And there's already a fair few players out there that are at that level, specifically team of the year and prime icon moments. Um, but for Brandt, this again, it, it will depend on what the the price is dead eye makes him a 94 rated cam brilliant 93 left wing brilliant again um we can get him to 93 basically in all of the attacking areas an artist makes him a 94 rated cam as well again fantastic and again you're boosting his stats to being super like really really super in in many regards architects not really what we want powerhouse is okay maestro takes him to a 94.4 cam and is probably the best chem style for him. It boosts his passing and vision way up, uh, boosts his dribbling way, way up as well. You know, 96 dribbling, 92 passing, 89 shooting, fantastic stuff. Engine also gets him to a, a high rated cam. I think cam's probably the best. In terms of pace, engine's really good for him. It's just that his shooting will be uh, letting you down. Uh, Guardian, we're not interested in. Gladiator, Hunter's a bit weak this year as a chem style. So yeah, you've you got a few options there. You could put an engine on him and get into a 94 cam. You could put a maestro on him, which I probably would do. I would say the maestro is probably the best chem style for him. So although he's not end game, right? Although he's only a 94 rated cam or 94.4 rated cam, if he's like, I would say honestly, 200,000 coins or less, 150k specifically, I would actually say this is a brilliant, brilliant card. Let's have a look at what EA are requiring from us. 184 rated cards, no inform. Sorry, 183 rated team, no informs. An 83 rated team with one inform. Is that an 85 rated team with no informs? I tell you guys, that is brilliant. That, that is honestly sensational value. Let's start with the German team. That is brilliant value. I, I, I actually think this is going to come in at 83 rated squads with no informs are going to be no more than 30k a piece. 
Uh, so we'll say 60k there and an 85 rated squad with no informs, maybe 50k. I, I think we're going to be looking at about 120k for this card. I honestly think this is this is the best value for money SBC we've had in a long, long time. So we need an 85 rated squad with only 70 chemistry, same nation, max five, Germans, minimum three. So we'll go to the Bundesliga to start with and see what we've got floating around. Let me go to gold because if I've got any untrade, I have got a whole bunch of untradeables and I just want to know, I don't want to use Neuer. Um, so we'll pop in Hradecki there. Um, in at right back. Do I have an untradeable? Nope. I was hoping I'd have a Kimmich in there. Uh, we can put Sule and Tart in there. And again, if I do have an untradeable centre-back, I will go and take him instead of what we've got going on here. I don't. Uh, I do, just not high enough rated. And then left back, David Alaba can go in. We do need an 85 rated squad here. So uh, we can pop Witzel in and Javi Martinez. But again, I want to just check... Now, again, I, I actually need an 80... What is it? Same nation, max five. I actually need an 80-something rated squad, but we only need 70 chemistry. So let me go now and get myself the untradeables and see what we've got floating around. I already have enough Germans. So if I've just got a couple of high-rated, you know, 87 and 86 rated kind of SBC cards, I'll be more than happy to use them in this SBC. And we'll hopefully wait to see what the... Um, what the price is so i've gone back to the wrong screen for you there you go you can see a little bit better for me now um you can see the the chemistry and such so yeah here we go looking for my 86s surely i've got an 86 or two we've got 85 sammy kadira is that all i've got i might take that 87 lukaku then he has obviously he only has uh the the rating for me that's it he's only worth an 87 because he's not a playable card i don't play on this account anyway we pop him in there um we'll pop javi martinez sorry sammy kadira in there and then if we go to what we've we got 84s and 85s 187 let's go to the calcio a again sorry the city maybe we've got douglas costa floating around nope no perisic either geez I, i've i've burnt a whole bunch of players haven't i fair play um alexander i don't particularly want to use rajan anglin i don't mind using and edin jeko i don't mind using that gets our chemistry and it puts us to an 84 rated. Now, let me just have a look at right backs. Is 83 enough? Yes. 82? No. Well, there you go. Jao Cancelo fits in there perfectly. Nice and easy for a prime goal players pack as well. Three Germans, five nation from, well, five max from the same nation. Minimum four clubs. Really easy. You can just do a full Bundesliga squad here, an 85 rated Bundesliga squad. They're relatively affordable. And because it only requires 70 chemistry, you can just throw in, like I did, like three or four just random players that you've got either untradeable or laying around the club. You know, you've got like Brahimi, a good 85 that you can put in there. Jonas, a good 84 that you can put in there. There's quite a few cards in there of 85s and 84s that are pretty good. And we're going to get a walkout as well. Um, first decent pack we've had, well, depending on what it is. Brazilian, goalkeeper, at least be the Liverpool. Yes, 87 rated Alisson. That's not bad. That's going to be a nice little, uh, what, what are 87s right now? Like 20k, 25k. So he's coming in. At 130,000 coins. 20k so far for the Bayer Leverkusen squad. 20k, 25 k for the Bundesliga squad. And 130k for the Germany squad. Oh no, it's just, sorry, 85k. And, and we know that that's going to probably come down. So it's probably going to come down to about 110 to 115k. This for me, guys, is just brilliant value. I, I honestly think for, you know, for a good card that has good possibilities in your team... Um, decent packs, well, you get some packs back. I don't want to say decent packs. Uh, then we need a team of the week one and then an 83 rated 80 chemistry. And, and again, the reason why this is so easy because it only requires 80 odd chemistry. Um, and the reason why that's important is obviously because you can, again, get away with just a whole bunch of nothingness in there. Uh, I think we used our 283. So have I got that covered? Team of the week. So I just need one team of the week. So let me just go to the Bundesliga and get my first team of the week in there. Hopefully an 82 or an 83. So we could put Sancho in there. And that just gives some chemistry to these guys. And then we just need an 83 rated squad. So let's go to um, let's go to La Liga. Lots of good 83s in La Liga. And we should be able to put like Gerard Moreno and William Jose. Adariz. Brilliant stuff there. Cam has got like Benega or Sarabia. 
Uh, center mid has like Manu Trigueros, and I might have already used some of them. Yeah, I have. Um, let's just go and get our, our our 83s. And this this one's only coming in at 25k, which is brilliant. Um, hopefully, we get a better, you know, just a little bit of a better setting on it. Let's take all of these guys. Rafinha. Ooh, I might have to take an 84 and then a few 82s. Yeah, it's come down already. It's like 127. I, do I think it's going to get much lower than that? Not really. Um, we can use him because he is super duper cheap. We can use Promes because we only need 80 chemistry. And we can use Lamar in that left back spot as well. Let's put then Vasquez in there. That takes us to 73 chemistry. And Gabriel Paulista in there. Now that's a team rating, just not the team chemistry. That's not the team rating, but it's better for chemistry. That is the team rating again, and the chemistry. Now, I just want to see if I can bring in an 82 over an 83. I can't. So, that is the perfect amount right there, guys. I've got one 84, uh, one, two, three, four 82s, and then six 83s. And this 84 rated card, he last I looked anyway, he was like 1,800 coins. I don't know, it looks like he might be up towards like 3, 4k right now. But I still think this is super, super value for money. And for completing this set, if it's going to turn in, do we get a goal, a premium gold players pack? So a 25k pack. So you get a prime gold, a premium gold, and a small prime electrum. Um, so the prime gold is 45k. The, uh, wait, why did it not go? Oh, I'll go to the pack afterwards. Yeah, the prime gold is um, 45k. The premium gold is 25k. So that's 70k of packs. And a small Prime Electrum, I think, is a 10k pack. So you get 80k's worth of packs. You get yourself a 88-rated card, which has some value. What is it, like 35k for an 88-rated card? Um, oh, wow, Leverkusen players minimum two. I've already used some of the Leverkusen. I know I have, haven't I? Hopefully, I still have... Um, hopefully, I still have some of the Leverkusen good cards available. I don't. My bad. Um, I'm going to have to pop in a few 84s. It's not, not the end of the world. Not the end of the world at all. We could throw him in there. And let's pop Bender in there. And then let's just go and get some... We'll start again with some more Bundesliga players. Uh, any 84s that we've got available. Well, I, I will need to take an 84. So we'll take him. We'll take Goretzka. Yeah, I think this is... I, I, I genuinely think this is a very, very, very strong... Um, SBC, uh, which is surprising because we haven't said that for a fair while about some SBCs that EA have given us. Now, we need 85 chemistry here. Same, oh, same league, max four. So, let's get rid of him. Let's go ahead on into, let's have a look. If we've got like an 84, I think we've got like a, yeah, uh, Mandzukic. It just depends whether we've got the cams or the center mids. No cams here. Uh, what about some center mids and some CDMs that we can throw in? We've got any good ones here? Alan... Bonaventura and Pastore can go in. And do we have any CDMs? Not that I need... I only need one anyway, but... Let's pop those two in. Let's just try and get a bit better rating here. So let's actually pop uh, Lucas Leiva. No, he doesn't work, does he? It has to be centre mids. Uh, we could take him there. We could take him there. So with the 84 and with the 84 Hradecki... Oh, I don't have Hradecki in there. So I'm, I'm going to need another 84... Uh, from another league so let's go to the premier league might have to take like a Jorginho or something like that um although the right backs are a problem position but center backs aren't because we have like socrates and and all sorts of others that put nabby cater in there and then in a cdm we shall take oh no i want center back sorry hopefully a socrates or something like that in there i don't really want to use eric Bailly, but that only takes us to 81 rated And then the right back only takes us to 82 rated. Let's go and see. I don't even have the chemistry. In fact, far, far from it. Let's see what other Premier League players we've got. Because if we can get a good link to Naby Keita or something, we should be okay. And if I've got an untradeable as well, we should be more than okay. I could link him with Firmino, but I think that's a bit overkill. Um, Robertson is okay. Pickford, I don't really care about. Willian is okay, but I don't really have chemistry to fit Willian in Robertson does Rob, wow I actually only, only need an 83 rated instead of an 82 so if we pop him in there 
that takes us to 79 chemistry. So I just need to get six chem points. So a Liverpool centre-back that's 82 rated. And I think there are... Isn't there two of them? Or are they 81s? They're 81s. Oh, it's still enough rating. That's interesting. That's very interesting. I popped an 82 up to an 83. And that ticked over the rating. And then I removed an 82 from an 81. And it still kept the rating. But there you go, guys. Um, nice and easy. The Liverpool triangle there of Keita, Robertson and Matip. 85 chemistry, 83 rated, and that is the Brandt card. Um, and I want to have a look as well, again, at what value, because what, you know, as you guys know, I, I'm very big on trying to find value in this game. Um, and the cheapest 88 rated card right now is selling for, what have we got going on here? Cheapest 88 is 30,000 coins, which is Higuain, and then 35,000 coins for Rodriguez. So let's see if Higuain is actually that cheap or if he's just been listed lower. Yeah, he, he's actually 35k as well. So for your 130k or so outlay, and you guys will be able to do most of this with untradables, which do still have the opportunity cost, of course, um, but I still think it's important. It, it, it's come down to 125k on Fatbin. So for 125,000 coins, you get a card that has a value of around 30 to 35,000 coins. You get 80,000 coins worth of packs, which in, you know, in some respects aren't necessarily the best packs, that's for sure. And you get a decent card. You know, this is more like, this is, this is for me is an SBC that's going to actually entice me to do it on the road to glory because it has a lot of positives about it rather than just being something that's stupidly overpriced that won't get into my team. This is a card that, okay, he's not necessarily groundbreaking. He, he will make a good cam if you've got a Bundesliga squad. If you've already got player of the month Goretzka or player of the month Royce, he's going to strong link into those cards. Uh, if you've got Michael Balak, he'll strong link into him. You know, there, there's a lot of good stuff about this Brandt card. Um, and I, I rate that. You know, I rate that. This this definitely is better than... Like, the, uh, so far I've been running like three tiers, right? I've been running the terrible value for coins, good value for coins, and neither value nor... Neither good value nor bad value for coins. This is somewhere in between reaching towards good value for coins and I, I think especially if you started the game late you know if, if you came if you came to FIFA at Christmas or if you've only got the game since Christmas this is a quality quality card for 120,000 coins and I recommend you do it I, I think it's worth it I absolutely think it's worth it this so guys is going to be the end of the video if you did enjoy it be sure to leave a like rating comment and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already but for now guys I'm out peace